think it's a game. Yes, that's right. Hello, welcome back to the Big Chair Show. I am your host, Millamani, and this is my big chair. Let's get this video started. Let's face it, sex is awesome, sometimes. And it's the reason why we're all here. Everyone's done it, and everyone loves it, except for kids. Don't even try to act like you got some cutty before. I got some cutty last night. Shut the fuck up! The only person who should be getting some cutty in this house is me. Oh, I forgot. So if you know me, you know I like to get wasted, and I like to smoke. Which brings a question to my mind. Drunk sex or high sex? Yes. All right, let's talk about drunk sex first. Drinks make your body feel good. It feels nice and warm inside. Cuddling is 10 times better. And since you're drunk, you won't care about the smaller things like bad breath or eating the booty. The drunk kisses are much more passionate. It is a known fact that if you were at the perfect amount of drunk, you could go for a while. One time, a bottle of Ciroc gave me power for an hour. <laughs> and that's okay in my book. Drunk sex is awesome. It makes you forget about everything. Stress, bills, that cat you ran over last week, it's all gone. The only thing that matters is that pussy. One bad thing about drunk sex is you're gonna have to piss sooner, you know, because you just consume so much alcohol. So you're having sex, and then you gotta piss. Every guy knows how hard it is to piss with a boner. It's difficult, man. Piss gets everywhere. I don't even fuck around, I just sit down. By the time you're done pissing, by the time you're done pissing, your boner will be gone. I'm sorry, it's very hard to get back. Just give me a minute, baby. Just give me a minute. Walk walk back and forth. Uh, maybe maybe it'll do something. Oh, finally! Tall guy's back. Welcome back to the party, man. Oh, gotta piss again. Shit. This is an important tip. Be careful. If you get too drunk, you might have just banged a three. And that is simply unacceptable, sir. No, nope, don't add that point. Don't add that point. Threes are not considered points in the book. Another bad thing about drunk sex is once you finish, you are... Finished. Oh, tired out. Oh, that was exhausting and amazing at the same time. Out. You will not wake up, I promise. Okay, so there's that. Now let's talk about high sex. Now, I don't know about you, but when I smoke, I get antisocial and nervous. If I'm nervous, no boner. It's a big issue. Especially if you're new to me. If I really don't know you and that I smoke and come around you, I probably won't talk to you. But believe it or not, one time I had this girlfriend who I would leave in my room and go outside to go smoke. When I come back to my room, she'd be all pissed that I left her in there. I don't care. But that's not the point. The point is, every time I smoked and came back, things were different. Either she was much more annoying, much uglier, or her breath stinked a lot worse. It was one of the three. I don't, I don't know, man. Weed and girls kind of just don't, I don't, they don't mix with me. When you're drunk, you don't care. I'll make out with the dumpster can when I'm drunk. But when you're high is when you notice things. It opens up your mind. That's nasty. One of the days I was so blazed out in my room just laying with her, I thought she was simply gross. Like, why am I dating you? It opens up your mind sometimes. Here's one good thing about high sex. When you're blazed, your imagination is awesome. So with that being said, if you are banging a god-awful chick, close your eyes during sex and use your high imagination. Boom! Now you're banging a supermodel. Mmm, that's some pretty good information, Melomani. That's no problem, it's no problem at all. So, with all this information taken account for, I'd have to pick both. Drunk and high sex. Like Hannah Montana said it, you get the best of both worlds. But, if I were to have to pick, I would pick drunk sex. I just haven't had good experiences being high and doing that. Yep, my parents are downstairs. Okay, that's about it for this video, guys. Would you rather prefer drunk sex or high sex? Have you ever even had sex? Are you subscribed to my channel yet? These are all very important questions. Answer them in the comment section below, and I will be sure to check them all out. Oh. Thank you all for watching. I am your host of the Big Chair Show, Millamani. I will see your sexy ass next Monday. Ah. Aight. Peace. Aight. Peace.